Hi and welcome. In this tutorial, we are going to talk about something that uh, kind of bothers all new uh, Moodle administrators. So, if you are a newbie Moodle administrator, do watch this. So, when we define any course in Moodle, one of the course settings is files and uploads. Now, when we install Moodle out of the box, the maximum upload size is set as 2 MB. Okay. So, this setting determines the largest size of the file that can be uploaded to the course, limited by site-wide settings, set by an administrator, activity modules also include a maximum upload size settings for part of the structure and assigned file size. So, this is the site-wide limit to MP. So, most people come and complain that, uh, sir, we are, on, we are not able to upload anything more than 2 MB. How do we increase this? Kaise isko jaye? The answer is quite simple. Uh, but first, we need to understand where this 2 MB is coming from. This 2 MB limit is not a modal limit per se. It's a limit that we inherit from uh, PHP. In PHP, the default upload limit that is set is uh, 2 MB. It is set in a file called php.ini, the uh, PHP initialization file for Apache. So that is where we have to make a couple of, uh, not couple, actually three changes. And then we need to re restart our Apache web server and we'll be able to see this. So in this particular case, uh, the faculty members have been trying to upload uh, lecture videos and they wanted uh, this 2 MB limit to be increased to uh, 500 MB. So that's exactly what we are going to do here. This is the, so we just go through the steps. So as I said, we have to do it from the server. So therefore, we, our server is already open. So the file that we're going to edit here is that, as I said, php.ini. Uh, if you don't know where the file is, and the path will depend on the distribution and the versions and other things. So you can always use this lo command locate, locate php.ini. So you'll find quite a few of them. This first one is what we are after. So let's open with the nano editor. And there we have it. Let's so say there are th three things we need to change. The first thing is the variable the system setting which is called post max size so let's search for it post max size so yeah there we have post max size now just because we are doing the edit let us add a comment that we made this change Oops. Um, it's always a good practice to put in the date when you are making a change so that uh, you know so here post max size is going to be 500 MB. Okay. I'll just copy this because we need to do it in a, two more places. The post max size is set. Let's look for the next one and that is upload max file size. Yeah. Maximum upload size for uploaded for maximum allowed size for uploaded files. Something happened with your copy it properly or whatever. So twenty nine zero eight updating for right now it was 2 MB, we will make it 500 MB. And there 
is one more that has got nothing to do with file size, which we need to change, which is max execution time. Now, max execution time of scripts in seconds. So here it is the it's the default which is 30 seconds. Now 30 seconds may be good for general purpose, but when we are uploading a big file, it might take longer. So we need to up 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 it up to 10 minutes. That's a long enough time to upload a file. Should be viewable. And let's save this file. Okay. Now we need to restart our Apache web server. So this new settings are read in. Let's restart it. Let's go back to Moodle. So it's still here. Let's do a refresh. And let's there you have it. Right, so that's how things are. It's pretty simple. Five minutes, and you should be up and running. Thank you for watching.